According to reports, George Soros backed Orleans Parish, Louisiana, regional lawyer and mother, on Monday night, were deported by two suspects allegedly pointing to high-power automatic rifles. The Fox 8 in New Orleans said that Keith Lampin, a regional prosecutor's office, also confirmed Jason Williams and was deported by a gun to the car while helping the car. Da Williams her mother were not damaged, and they both thank them to the New Orleans Police Department for their strict work tonight for responding to the victims of crime every night, said. New Orleans also calls for a national response to violence that oppresses U.S. cities this is a triage. Moment police said that the two armed suspect approached Williams at around 10 o'clock to Black Lincoln Navigator. After receiving SUV, suspect could not go far. Williams told the station, because there was still key fob. Police said SUV was gathered in the city center of New Orleans. Americans in New Orleans warn this capital coming alone on Tuesday. He interviewed Fox 8 Williams in his office and said two suspects did not look like a child. Williams said the suspect had high powerful automatic weapons and that his mother bought items from SUV, including his belongings, but would not go into details. It is important to repeat that my mother and I have only a small part of the number of people affected by violence in this city. He continued we have to work collectively on our efforts to prevent crime. Policing efforts and prosecution efforts. New Orleans Police Union leader rips. Progressive politicians on crime and law enforcement problems police said the same suspects were accused of continuing 22-year-old woman in a shorter than half mile. And about 30 minutes after looking at if arrests were made in connection with the incident and made. Williams said that he plans to withdraw himself like his office office. Earlier this year, Williams issued a terrible warning against violence in city and throughout the country as he continued to destroy city. Exonered suspects are suing for the role of corrupt clays in the prosecution he joined the American newsroom and discussed how to reduce high violence of all time and presented suggestions about what could be done to reverse the tendency. I say that Rome is burning and this does not have to be hyperbolic. I've been playing this alarm for more than a year. Not only in New Orleans, but also in the whole country. This outbreak of violence is not limited to the boundaries of New Orleans. But this is the area I focused. The comments arrived after explosion of the gunshot outside restaurant. During New Orleans Jazz and Heritage Festival, a employee customer was injured. Former New Orleans officers Clement's proposal rejected in the 1995 case nevertheless. Some accuse Williams' selective prosecution about violence. When Williams was elected in 2020, he ran on a social justice reform platform with the intention of finding alternative 